as you're concerned, exporting wine into the states is that is that opening up nicely? Yeah, it is. You know, the U.S. market for uh, for wine is very good, and it's it's because the middle part of America has really started to find wine, and it's a long story as how they did. There used to be big beer and bourbon drinkers in, in the Midwest, and wine. You know, what's that stuff? You know, no you drank wine if you were out on the East Coast or the West Coast. Uh, and many years ago, probably 10 years or so ago, they had a lake of Chardonnay, in, uh, particularly out of California uh, in the United States, and they just couldn't sell it. And someone picked it all up and bottled it and distributed it for two US dollars a bottle. And it was called Two Buck Chuck. And Two Buck Chuck. And <laughs> they everyone, could have used slightly better. Well, wording. that's basically it, because, what, because it was a chuck out product. And, and what <clears throat> the wine industry thought there was, that'll be the end of the US wine industry. You cannot put wine at that price on the US market. And it, it, the market survived. But completely, and I actually, as per often, I'm, I sort of see the things the other way. Um, I thought the time was an absolutely fantastic move. A, it removed the lake instantly. This guy just went around and bought wine for 20 cents a litre and put it, because obviously the bottle and tax and all those sort of things makes a big contribution and margin for the retailer. So it was still being retailed at $2 a bottle. And what it did is what I thought it would do. In the Midwest and in other parts of the United States, people would buy a bottle of this because it's 13% alcohol for $2. Wow. You know, we have to buy half a dozen bottles of beer to get the same amount of alcohol we're getting of a bottle. And so they tried it. Hmm. That was interesting. I wonder what we pay. I wonder what a $4 bottle would be like. I wonder what an $8 bottle would be like. I wonder what a $16 bottle would be like. And all of a sudden you open up a whole part of the market that had been big beer bourbon drinkers to a taste product that they would never have done before. It was always seen as an elite product, too expensive, etc. So it actually did a, did a fabulous job. Uh, and that part of the United States is growing, growing very, very strong.